much is enough? Do you know exactly how much money you need to live the life that you desire? You see, the truth is, most people think they want more than they actually need and settle for a lot less than they could actually get. Stay tuned because today we're going to talk about why clarity matters when it comes to attracting abundance. Welcome to Empowered Thursday. My name is Danny. I'm a hypnotherapist that helps lady bosses get out of their own way, tame the inner critic so that they can find peace in the chaos. You might call me the peace teacher. Welcome. If you are new here, hi, how's it going? Be sure and subscribe, turn on notifications by clicking that bell so that you'll get notified when a new video is posted every week. All right, so let's get started. <laughs> One of the things I find is that when we talk about attracting more abundance or having more abundance, oftentimes we aren't clear on exactly what it is we want. We have these vague ideas. We say, I want more money. I want more clients. I want a new house. But is that really clear? So last year, I wanted to earn a specific amount of money in my business. So I wrote that number down on a piece of paper. I wrote it on a card. I carried it with me in my pocket. I put it on my wall near my desk. I had it as my wallpaper on my phone. I had an affirmation around it. I would visualize it every morning. It was my one thing for the year. It was my number one focus. And at the end of the year, I hadn't met my goal. I hadn't earned the amount of money that I had said. I was a little bummed, right? I had done everything that the experts had told me to do, everything that I knew, but yet I didn't earn the amount of money in my business that I had set out to earn. So a couple months later, I'm doing my taxes and I'm adding all the numbers together and bam, it's as clear as day. I had actually received the exact amount of money that I had been focusing on all year. Actually, a little bit more, actually a hundred, a couple hundred dollars more than, than I had actually stated. Wow, the universe had given me exactly what I wanted. But yet, it wasn't, was it? I had said I wanted to earn this amount of money. But in my mind, I was thinking that was from my business that I had this many sales or this many clients that earned that amount of money. But indeed, that money came from me from other sources. So you see, this was something that I failed in, right? I wasn't clear, I knew my number, but I wasn't clear about what it was that I exactly wanted. We often do this, don't we? You see, the universe will always provide to you what you ask for. Even now, you are receiving exactly what you ask for. It may not necessarily be what you truly want. So let's look at this from the perspective of money. Because a lot of us, you know, we want more money, right? Who wouldn't want more money? So let's think about this for a second. If I say that I want more money, is that really clear? Not really, right? Because if I were to find a dollar on the floor right now, I might pick it up and now I have more money. You see, when we are very clear about what it is that we want, that is how we're able to attract it. So let's take this idea of money for a second. Now, I'm gonna challenge you to shift your perspective just a bit. And what I mean by that is let's look at it from a different viewpoint. When we think about wanting more money, it's generally because we want a certain lifestyle, right? We want a certain house, we want a certain car, certain clothing, certain items, certain travel. Maybe there's freedom in there of time, right? Maybe some bills are gone. What is that for you? Take a moment and think about 
How is it that you want to live? Do you own your own home? Uh, where do you live, right? Uh, do you take vacations? How many vacations do you take? Are you traveling in economy or business class or first class, right? Or are you on your own private jet? Or is it your friend's jet, right? You see how I'm getting even more specific there? What I want you to do is in as much detail as possible is get really clear on how it is that you want to live. When you think about the home that you live in, is it one home? Is it several homes? Where is it located, right? Is it in one country or another country? One city, another town? Are there people who are there to maintain the maintenance of the house or are you doing that? Uh, what does your neighborhood look like, right? And then when you think about your car, what kind of car do you have? Do you own the car? Is it a lease? If you think about your travel, where are you going? Are you traveling locally? Are you going international? And then when you go, where do you stay? Is it a first class resort? Is it an all inclusive? Is it a five, five star? When you think about excursions, what excursions are you going out while you're there? Or are you staying local and just kind of chilling out in the resort? When you think about going on vacation, how long is it? Is it seven days? Is it a, a month? Is it three months? When you think about going out to eat, what type of restaurants are you eating at? How much do you spend on a typical meal at this restaurant? And what I want you to do is as you start thinking about all these things about how you want to live, start kind of adding up how much that would cost. So if you go out to eat at a restaurant, how much is your meal? How much are you spending, right? And then how many times a week do you go out and eat? If you think about that car, right? Did you buy it cash? Did you get a loan for it? Is it a lease, right? How much money is going out? When you think about your home and the maintenance, right? Are there people coming in? How much are you paying them to do that? You see how we get really clear about what it is that we want. So I'm gonna challenge you to do just that. Get exactly all the details of everything that you absolutely want. Now, we're using money here, but you can do this for anything. Let's say you want to attract a new home. Maybe you want a new, more clients, right? Maybe you wanna increase your business by 20, 30% this year. Or maybe you have a particular goal in mind that you want to achieve. Whatever it is that you want to attract, get absolutely clear about what that looks like. In as much detail as possible, write it all out. You might even want to create an affirmation about it and I would challenge you to visualize it every single day. Our subconscious mind doesn't know whether it's real or fake. It takes everything as real. So doing that process of, of visualization, I actually have a visionary exercise video that I will link here in the video somewhere so that you can check that out because uh, it's a really great exercise. It takes like two to three minutes. You can do every single morning, but after you've gotten exactly clear about what it is. All right, so that is our action item for the week. Get in as much detail as possible in what it is that you want to attract, love, business, relationships, a new home, whatever that might be. Write it down in as much detail as possible. Be absolutely clear. Create some affirmations. Do the visioning and really focus in on what it is that you want to attract. When you do this, the universe is going to send to you what you need to accomplish that goal. And you're gonna be able to see when it's coming. That's the amazing thing. That is what Clarity does. If you wanna continue the conversation, be sure and come on over to the Empowered You community. That is our Facebook group. We are over there doing weekly talks that are exclusive for the group, challenges, helping you take the driver's seat of your life. I'll put a link down below so that you can come join us uh, this week as we continue the conversation. All right, that is it for us today. If you enjoyed this video, please let me know by giving me a thumbs up and let me know in the comments below if you've ever done an exercise like this before and how it worked out for you. And as always, remember to be you and to be amazing. Bye!